morning guys today is wednesday i don't see you guys sometimes the days are just such a blur but it's wednesday and it is five after six and i have to leave here in about 10 minutes so we gotta get our stuff ready guys um i know i've been here Ooh, focus focus on me oh. um yeah i haven't done a blog a day in the life of a nurse but we're gonna get it done today so i'm getting ready for work i start work at seven and i live about 40 minutes away so we're about to get that done um currently i am working at a long-term care and a support living home so it works for me i recently just went casual that's another story for another day but yeah <sighs> I'm about to go get ready now, you guys. Work has been hectic. Don't mind the way I look. I am prepping my hair. But work has definitely been hectic. Um, a lot of people have been quitting, going casual, um, just finding other jobs because right now everywhere is hiring. So, I mean, like, you can't blame them, right? But it is what it is at this point. Everyone's looking up for themselves. Um, everyone wants to level up, so I can't even blame them. But let me just get my hair over and done with because I'm running super late and I'll see you guys soon. multiple choice questions and your NCLEX you guys they're very very important because it'll help you strategize how to take the test sometimes it's not even about knowing the knowledge it's just basically knowing how to read and interpret what they're asking you so just to give you like a little bit about me because this is my first vlog um I've been a nurse for about two years now two years in August and I've bounced around from community health public health 
um, vaccination clinics because I did graduate in 2020 and that's when um, COVID started. So there's a lot of job opportunities, thankfully, because when I was in school, they told us how it's so hard to get a nursing job once you're out of school. I've been looking for uh, years or probably months to get the actual job that I wanted. That wasn't the case for me, thankfully. As soon as I graduated, two weeks later, I got my first nursing job. So that was such a blessing. So yeah, I bounced around from hospital to long-term care to retirement home to public health to vaccination clinics. And now I'm settled in a uh, long-term care and uh, retirement home. Not because I settled, quote unquote, but now because that's what I wanted to do. I did not want to go back in hospital right now. Um, so yeah, I'm RPM in Ontario and LPM in Alberta. But yeah, that's about it now. Um, what I want, what I want to say. Oh yeah, so because I've been a nurse for so long, I do know how to um, just answer nursing questions and study because I had those two years of experience. So I want to share that with you guys and make sure that you guys are also on the same page and you guys have the confidence that I gained while I was in nursing school. Child, there is so much traffic. Let me focus on the road again because there's so much construction going on. So I'll talk to you guys later. Hey guys, so I'm on break right now currently. It is now 11 o'clock. Um, work is okay. Um, I'm gonna actually grab something to eat. I don't know what, but I'm gonna figure out what to eat because I'm actually really hungry. Um, my fish break at 3.30 today, or 3.15 rather. So yeah, if I don't get nothing to eat now, I'll just eat after. Hi, can I help you? Hi, can I get us uh, medium fries? Okay with a strawberry lemonade mixed with a little bit of Sprite, no ice? Yeah, so medium lemonade with a bit of Sprite, no ice? Yes, please. Okay, the strawberry or regular? Um, strawberry. Okay, anything else? No, that's it, thank you. Regular, please. Thank Thanks. You. you guys haven't tried it? Strawberry lemonade with Sprite? Thank me later. Thank you. Here you go. There you go.
guys so i'm done work now um it is 3 30 i'm about to go home um i'm kind of hungry actually but i'm not gonna eat nothing because there's food at home my husband made food so yeah you guys that's just how my day was i couldn't really record for obvious reasons but yeah hey guys so i hope you guys enjoyed my little vlog i did not want it to be too long on the first try because i'm still getting to know you and you're still getting to know me but i just want to show you guys how a day in the life of a nurse is like i mentioned this morning i do work in retirement home and long-term care but i recently went casual so i'll let you guys know about that in a different story time but i just want to show you guys how i basically go about my day if I do have work in like three consecutive days, I don't do too much because I want to preserve my energy for that shift. Like the shift could get so crazy that I don't want to like burn myself out while I'm at home. Cause I, would, I want to like reset my body, um, make sure that I'm ready and up and not like tired for that shift. Um, but right now I'm actually going to go do a video for you guys, a dosage calculation video. This channel... I want to tell you guys that this channel is mainly to help new nurses and nursing students as well gain confidence as they practice nursing. A lot of times um, when it comes to dosage calculation or math in general, a lot of us nurses, we tend to like freak out a little bit because we came into biology so that way we don't have to do math. <laughs> you know what I mean? But have no fear. I got you guys. Um, I am one that does not like math. I totally freaked out. Actually, when I went to go do my test to get into nursing school, I failed because of math. 
So while um, I was in nursing school, I found simple ways on how to basically calculate what they're asking and I used to get it right. And you guys, I'm trying to simplify it as much as possible for you guys because I know how it is. So I got you, okay? I got you. So this video that I'm going to be recording is going to be about dosage calculations. So just look out for that video. It's going to be really good, really simple, really easy um, for you guys. And I also do have two videos, like I mentioned before, um, on how to pass your NCLEX or CPNRE and how to answer select all the apply questions. So... If you guys are interested, make sure you guys go look at those videos. I'll put the link up here somewhere and also in the description box down below. Again, thank you guys so much for supporting me and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!